Welcome back to Australia. Uh, a few ways to go here, I guess. Are you open? You are. Huh. Okay. It's funny, there is an X over it, but if I try to interact with it, it still creates an actual cutscene. Very patient. Okay. Whoa. Okay, jeez. In here I thought I had puzzles to do. seems to continue to be there. It's just one, insulated by lots of electrical activity and two, somehow the land is gone? It's just sea everywhere, which is odd. And it's also sustaining life up above in the clouds, weirdly. So it doesn't seem like it was just totally destroyed in a, like, salted earth kind of way. No shortage of wars in this world. This is an odd looking library. Okay, well, nothing to do going straight here or there. Okay. Oh, what? No. Never mind. It's oriented the wrong way. On the, on the ground. Boom. Everything better be a one-tap pickup with these hydraulics that I have. I'm gonna be disappointed if I ever have to expend actual effort to pick something up. You can't tell what way something's oriented just when you first look at it. Because it might just be located the other way. I like how he hops off the front of his mech whenever he hops off the thing. For some reason I find that satisfying. Dare I? Huh. Cool. It actually has a floating animation too. Oh never mind, it floats regardless. Never mind. But the floating animation kinda justifies it anyways. So that's one thing I can do, but can I also... I can also take that over here, can't I? Okay. I to reorient this thing to see how... There you go. I have to pick it back up to, to see how it's actually oriented. Just really silly. Oh, hold on. 
not right where he's... Hold on. Did I pick the wrong one? That goes right. This one goes left, though. Is there anything interesting over here? I don't need this thing. Take a left piece. Do I have a left piece? It's a right piece. I don't think there are, are there any pieces I can take from anywhere else. It just seems like an interesting place to be able to go, because otherwise you wouldn't normally go there. I suspect this, this, yeah, this goes off to the left, so I need a right piece to... I mean, if I have right pieces, yeah, man. So I could do this to reach the exit now. I can also pick up more goodies. Oh, I get two for that one there. Very nice. Also, go just a little bit further. I don't know what I need this thing for. I, I, I've gone everywhere now. question the whole descent of humanity thing. I feel like that was a big line that just got thrown at us. Okay, I guess we've got a lot, we've got a lot to process. You're Lunger. Not sure where that comes from. It's implied to come from somewhere. For reference, by the way, the Japanese subtitle of this game is not um, Red the Hunter, it's Sore Karakola. That is usually translated as From There, Koda, or something like that. It's, it's hard to make sound natural, but... So yeah, so the Koda here is mentioned in the subtitle of the game originally. And <laughs> it takes this long to get to it. Dumb dog. Well, there's still stuff here, even if in a rather unusual configuration.
Ah, okay. Well, yeah, that's 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 where all the land went. It went up. It went up. So is there just sea life everywhere? No, it just created new life on the islands. Well, what's the point of protecting the actual big blue rock then? The only thing that the clouds seemed to be protecting was the Juno at that point. But they didn't talk about protecting the Juno, they talked to the, they talked about protecting the planet. But also, a significant portion of the planet was, you know, removed from the planet. That is, the land masses sit into the sky, at which point they put life back on it anyways. <sighs> I enjoy narratives where characters learn about the nature of their existence. I like more of that. Huh. What for? Why'd they do that? They just get tired and leave? I see. So they're just hiding. So why would Bio not listen to the Juno if his whole deal is activating the Juno and he was created to, you know, like, work with them? Oh, convenient. Speak of the devil. Yeah, that's the one thing that doesn't add up to me. Why would Bion base would be going rogue? But of course, to, he woke up early to begin with, so... Funnily enough, parts of this actually kind of remind me of the plot of, um, Panzer Dragoon Orda. I won't say more than that. But there are some odd similarities. In a certain abstract fashion. Maybe more thematically. Yeah, it's complicated. Alright, up we go. Let's bring the mech this time. You know, those floating things are really inconvenient. Yeah, I know, but these places exist and therefore I want to acknowledge them. How'd they get into the terminal room that fast? It took me forever to get in here. I guess I solved all the puzzles for them. Oh, nice. Well, um, well that ominous piece of meat now acknowledged, I guess that's probably a good time to... Uh, in that episode for whatever that's preparing us for. Hey everyone. <laughs>